In addition to the header layout, Youthin Pro can display menus and widgets published in the mobile dialog widget area, in a drop bar, off canvas sidebar, or a modal window. But first, let's publish a menu in the mobile dialog area. And as you can see, a toggle icon, which opens the dialog, automatically appears in the layout. Also, let's publish a widget in the mobile dialog area. Now let's go back to the mobile panel. Select the layout for the dialog area. In my case, I have an off-canvas top layout. Here, the items are displayed at the top of the off-canvas sidebar. All layouts have an additional option to center their content horizontally and to show or hide the close button. Also, dialog layouts have an option to push widgets published in the dialog mobile area to the bottom of the layout. Just set the number of items after which the following items are pushed to the bottom. You can also select the position for the dialog toggle. You can display the toggle at the start or end of the navbar mobile area or at the start or end of the header mobile area. Optionally, you can show the menu text next to the icon. Instead of using the off-canvas top layout, you can also select an off-canvas center layout. Here, the items will be displayed in the center of the off-canvas sidebar. For the off-canvas layouts, you can choose between the slide, reveal or push mode. In the slide mode, the off-canvas bar will slide on top of the page content. In the Reveal mode, the page content will move out of the viewport, revealing the off-canvas bar underneath it. And in the Push mode, the off-canvas bar will push the page content out of the viewport. Additionally, you can define whether the off-canvas sidebar opens on the left or on the right. You can also choose one of the drop bar layouts. Here, the items are displayed at the top or in the center of the drop bar. The drop bar stretches to the full width and height of the viewport, but does not overlay the navbar. So, navbar items remain clickable when the drop bar is open. Drop bar layouts have additional options to define their animation. For example, you can choose a fade animation where the drop bar fades in. The slide top animation where the drop bar slides in from the top revealing its content. The slide left animation where the drop bar and its content slide in from the left. Or the slide right animation. Here the drop bar and its content slide in from the right. Finally, you can also choose one of the modal layouts. Here, the items will be displayed at the top or in the center of the modal window. Modal layouts have an additional option to define the width of the modal content. 